Hello and welcome back to another video brought to you by the good people at FM Wonder Kids. Today we are talking hidden gems, attacking midfielder, centre hidden gems, otherwise known as cams or attacking midfielders or playmakers or number 10s. All these guys are going to be available at the start of the game for less than £10 million. Now, just to let you know how these videos work, we sim the game for 10 years. We scout all the players in the game that are worth over £10 million in, th in 10 years' time. Then we go back in time, find out how much those players cost to buy at the start of the game. And then we compile all the information in and send it out to the YouTuberverse. This is attacking midfielders. All these guys are available for less than 10 million quid at the start of the game. Where are they? Over there somewhere. Now, just a favour, if you like these videos, smash that like button. Hit subscribe if you are new. Thank you so much for all the support we've had lately. And head on over to Patreon if you want to download these shortlists or if you just want to support the channel, we do have a Patreon. So, without further ado, we'll go through the players that we've got today. This guy here, Peleo Moria. Remind you of anything, Lord of the Rings fans? Okay, what we like about this guy is his flair, okay? And he's not maybe not the quickest person, but he is really well-rounded. So he can, he's got free kick taken. He hasn't got many attributes that are white, but he's got a lot of yellows and greens, okay? Very, very cheap at the start of the game, this guy, and you will be able to develop him better than he gets here. Play, maybe play him in the centre of the park, centre midfield, he's got the attributes to do that. Next up then... Dario Sarmiento. Okay, now determination is this guy's strong point, acceleration and pace as well. So he's a fast left footed attacking midfield centre. Okay, he hasn't quite developed here in this save that how he could develop, but definitely someone worth looking out for at the start of the game. Okay, next up then, Miguel Beza. Okay, Beza now we're talking, we've got free kick taking first touch. Dribbling, flare, and look at that vision, 16. His work rate lets him down a little bit, but he's either footed, he's Spanish, and he is one to watch. Moving into the top four then, Mateus Palacios. Now, granted, Palacios isn't the best finisher, but look what he's got here. Decisions, determination, and flare, all green. Less than 10 million quid at the start of the game. He's 27 years old yet. Acceleration, agility, vision again, and passing, dribbling. Top three then, Santi Hassan. Look at this, finishing first touch and dribbling, that is what you want from your centre attack midfielder. Maybe I would be asking for long shots as well, but who am I to be greedy? Flair, determination, concentration, composure, acceleration, agility, and pace as well. An elite forward. Top two, Franco Tongia. Franco Tongia here in 2030, he is 27 years old. Okay, acceleration. Agility, balance, he's got so many greens. Determination at 18. Look how good he is mentally. Dribbling, passing. This guy is class. Six foot as well. Long shots, look, crucially, he's got that long shots there as well. Top of the tree then, Nasi Amval. We have mentioned him a few before in a couple of the videos previously. You might be able to get him for just under £10 million. And look. How good he is. We couldn't leave him off this list. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Videos coming out every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. We'll see you soon.